Hello everyone, welcome back to Tech Genie. In this video, I will be explaining that how to fix low performance issue after update on Windows 11 or Windows 10. Then watch this entire video and you will find a great change. So if you have recently updated your Windows operating system and you find that your system is now working very slow, freezing or lagging, then follow the simplest steps. So number one, what I would recommend you that you should run some kind of DISM scam. So click on your windows search type cmd right click on command prompt and choose run as administrator a black window will be coming up now here you have to paste few command that you will find in the description so open the description and copy the first command right click choose copy come back to the black window make a right click and it will be automatically pasted hit enter then copy the second command right click and it will be pasted hit enter now this command may take some time so what we can do we can move with the next solution so as of now we can minimize it now click on your windows search type file and from the suggestion click on file explorer then from the left in menu option click on this pc then click on local disk c then you have to look for windows double click on it and here you have to find software distribution so keep scrolling down until you find software distribution once you get it double click on it and now here you'll see all kind of update file that are no longer needed so what you can do you can press ctrl a from your keyboard to select all and then press the delete key to delete them all once done you can close it now right click on the windows icon then click on settings on windows 10 you can click on system and then you have to look for the storage option click on storage and now we can also open the black window once again and see that if this has been 100% completed so it's still it's running so we can minimize it again and now here you have to make sure the storage sense option has been enabled once done you have to click on it and here just make sure keep windows running option has been checked automatic user content cleanup option has been checked then come to run storage since now and click on it and once done you have to go back and then you have to look for the temporary file here click on temporary file and you will see all kinds of temporary file like recycle bin so if you don't need anything that has been deleted and moved to recycle bin and if you don't want to restore them you can check this option then you have windows update cleanup you can check this option delivery optimization download if you don't want the downloaded items in your folder then you can check this option and check all other options below and then click on remove file then click on continue and wait until this process has been completed once it's been done go back and now below you'll find advanced storage setting click on it and then you will find drive optimization click on it and here you just have to optimize your c drive where your operating system has been installed so click and select it and then click on optimize so just wait until this has been completed meanwhile you can minimize it again open your black window and we can see the command has been completed so now you need to paste the third command right click and paste it hit enter and once this command will be completed you need to finally paste the last command that is sfc space forward slash scan now so make sure you run all these four command and then you need to right click on the windows icon choose task manager now here you have to click on the startup tabs and here you need to disable all the third party application like microsoft team phone link discord skype steam so you just need to disable all these kind of application that you have manually installed on your PC. So make sure you only disable the startup application for third party apps and not any kind of audio or the Wi-Fi file. So once you are done, just restart your PC and after that your issue will be surely resolved. So that's all guys. Hopefully this solution will work for you. And if yes, do not forget to like and subscribe or any question, any problem, let me know in the comment section. And I see you in the next video. Bye-bye.